Hey, what's going on everybody? Brando free to play back on my free to play account and in today's video I'm just gonna be talking about traps and solo traps and rally traps What's the purpose of a trap? Are they good for the game? Are they a good play style stuff like that? Uh, I'm not really gonna have any gameplay in this video. It's just gonna be me talking Okay, now what is a trap? Let's start with that. Right, a lot of people have a, a different opinion on it. So here is my take on it. You may or may not agree. A trap is an account that appears to be very weak when in reality it isn't. Right? It's, a, it's an account that looks very, very weak, easily attackable, easily soloable, or an, an easy rally target. But then when you go to hit it, you realize, oh shit, this account is not as weak as I thought. I just got my leader captured. That is a trap. Now, a lot of YouTubers have made trapping popular and it has become very, very common to see solo trap accounts in the game. It has become somewhat common to see rally traps account in the game. Now, how people do it, that varies. A lot of people have different methods depending on their gear set, what heroes they have. Um, the first iteration of a solo trap was primarily based from T1 troops. Uh, then it kind of grew up and lost some T1 and it moved over to T2. But ultimately it was still millions of troops in a small low, low might castle. For instance, my account is too big to be considered a solo trap. Most good solo traps are within the range of 30 to 70 million might. That is the, the that, that's a decent range for a solo trap, right? Because it's weak enough where T4 players and some T3 players will be like, you know what? I might be able to fuck this guy up. I don't think he, he has many troops. And hopefully they are not a rally trap, or I mean, hopefully they're not a solo trap and they're able to do that. But if they are a solo trap, then they're kind of in trouble. But based on what I hear from people who have had solo traps, who have made solo traps, who have played the solo trap playstyle for a period of time, they pretty much all say the same things, like, it's boring. I didn't get anybody attacking me this KVK. I was unshielded the whole time that I was online. I didn't get any bites. I just sat there and I wasted my time. Right, I'm paraphrasing, but essentially, that's what they were saying. They were wasting their time because nobody hit them. Because traps have become so popular that everybody suspects that everybody is a trap of some sort. And I'll admit, I have hit traps and I am uh, wary of hitting a trap again. I don't want to have to lose my leader and have to, you know, get it rescued. That just wastes my time, it wastes the guild's time. And uh, in all reality, the person who has a trap is wasting their own time. Uh, it's, it is what it is because eventually that account will have to shield. Solo traps cannot remain unshielded for days at a time. They will get zeroed. Hands down. No, no doubt about it. They will get zeroed. Because solo traps cannot take a rally. They are a solo trap for a reason. So... I give you kind of the pros and cons about it. Let's move up into rally traps. 
Now a rally trap is what I am currently trying to make. What is a rally trap? So let me tell you, let me start off by telling you what is not a rally trap. So somebody like this, this is not a rally trap. If we rallied this guy, yeah, we'll get her, we'll, we'll get the leader captured. The march will be eaten. But he is not a rally trap. Not a rally trap by any form whatsoever. Because what is the definition of a trap? An account that appears weak, but isn't. This account does not appear weak strong as fuck this is not a weak account at all at all okay so with that an account like mine is quote unquote rallyable right if a billion might player full champion player sees me unshielded with an anti-scout on, what do you think they're gonna do? They're gonna set a rally on me. Hands down. No doubt about it, it's happened before. I have been rallied. I've shielded or I've had my troops hidden at that time, but I have been rallied. So, what makes me think that they won't rally me now or if I'm a little bit higher might? They will. It's just a matter of, you know, when they'll do it. They'll probably do it when they know I'm asleep. For how they know, I have no fucking idea and I really don't care. But once I have finished my rally trap and I built it up to a point where I am comfortable with it, I will be able to remain unshielded, collect leaders so I can execute them. You know, I'll be able to hold leaders the entire time. I don't have to go unshield, I don't have to shield up. That is what I want. That is the main reason why I'm building a rally trap because, I mean, if you look at my uh, prisoners executed, I have 285. 285 prisoners executed. That number hasn't changed in about a year because in no kingdom have I been able to go and remain unshielded with leaders and not get rallied or attacked to have those leaders released. It has not happened in like well over a year. And it's frustrating. It sucks. Right? So I want to be able to build my account up so that I can hold those leaders and execute them and get that altar boost up to like 500 days or something, right? That's what I want. That is the goal that I have. Now, whether or not that is something that I'm gonna be easily achievable, I already know it's not gonna be easy. It's gonna take a long time. I'm only a third of the way there for my, for my composition that I'm gonna be using. I'm only a third of the way there. And I will not share my composition until I tested it. Once I tested it and I know it works, then I can share it with you guys. But I'm not going to share something that I haven't tested. Because I don't want you guys to come back and be like, Oh, Brando, your composition sucks. It didn't work for me. Well, that sucks for you. It worked for me. Right? I don't want that to happen. So... Yeah, that's why I'm not telling you guys what it is. That's why a lot of people don't tell you what their composition is. Because it doesn't work for everybody. There is a general idea, which is good. Which is kind of what I'm basing mine off of. But the actual numbers have to match your account. That's all I'm going to say about it. Now... Traps, rally traps and solo traps, like I said, are useful. They have their purpose. 
They keep accounts in check. They keep us on our toes. They make people second guess and be like, you know what? Let me try this. They force people to play smarter instead of just throwing money at the problem. It forces them to reevaluate the mechanics of the game instead of throwing money at IGG to try to fix a problem. Now, what do you guys think about rally traps and solo traps in Lords Mobile? I definitely, definitely want to hear your guys' opinions, uh, your guys' compositions, if you want to share them, uh, both for solo and or rally traps. I know a couple rally trap comps. I know a lot of solo trap comps. So, yeah, just let me know what you guys think. And until next time, guys. See ya.